It's gotta be like a 50 pound flathead, bro. Dude. Go, 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 go. Take this. Here, take it on. Praying to the Lord, please don't let me lose this fish. Uh... What is going on, all the peeps? Welcome back to another epic video, guys. In today's video, I'm gonna be fishing for monster catfish. I'm here right now in North Florida. We just drove 400 miles all the way here dirt trails, we're in the middle of nowhere right now. And there's some monster channel catfish, there's monster flathead catfish. There's big gar. Big gar, there's all sorts of cool stuff here, guys. Everything. So we got shad, and we're gonna go ahead and whip these babies out, and uh, we're gonna set the rods down and uh, see what we can catch. Home to some of the largest freshwater fish located in Florida. The long nosed gar. This gar can grow up to be five to six feet in length and weigh over 50 pounds. And this is the Florida State record flathead catfish, which can also get massive. I start my journey here in the St. John's River. Fueled with anticipation and determination, we waited for the bite. Can I set out as far as you can? 12 o'clock. I've just hooked into a big fish and I have no clue what is on the other end of my line. Here, you gotta hand me the rod, bro. The river reaches depths of over 40 feet, or 12 meters to be exact, with a very steep drop off that is nothing to be fooled with. Alongside with how deep it is, there's multiple tree branches that lay across the water, making it hard to land a big fish. Can you help? Keep it tight, bro. Let's go, baby! Let's go, baby! Oh my god! Guys, he's dogging, he's dogging. Let's go. Oh my god, he's dogging me. Oh, he came Hang off. him in, bro. He came off? Damn it. I just hooked into another monster fish, and I'm trying to strategize how to land this fish without having it wrap me up. Is he taking line? Have it tight. Good. Pulling him in? No, let's move. Look. You don't see it? Holy cow. Oh, he's big. He's big. He's big. He's big. Go swimming, bro. Just go swimming if you have to, if it goes around there. Uh, broke me off. All right, guys, we're on a really big fish right now. <laughs> it's gotta be like a 50 pound flathead, bro. Dude. Oh my God. Gotta tighten up on him. Holy cow. Uh -oh. Make sure that hook is- be... Hold up, hold up, hold up. Hey. Oh, it's... This is now the third fish I've lost today. Long-nosed gar are known for having very bony, long jaws, which makes it hard to keep the hook into the fish. Action. Did he come off? All right, guys, we're on it. Oh my God, that's a nice fish. Dude, he pulled me in. I think he's hooked this time, Harris. Okay, well, make sure he doesn't go around that tree, start pumping him. This is probably the biggest one. This is the, actually the hardest pulling one I've had so far. This is it. This is probably the worst rod, but in history, I don't want to put it. <laughs> Just do it, bro. Dude, I'm gonna cry. Just do it. I'm not even gonna. I'm not gonna do it. Dude. You'll, it'll it hurt. Is, it is hooked so. I'm not. I'm not gonna take it, though. dude. Oh my god, it's coming up. Dude, the biggest catfish ever. Like this thing's pulling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, he's gonna come up. He's gonna come up. He's gonna jump hairs. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. It's huge. What is it? Oh no, Paris, Paris. The fish started moving down river, which caused a huge problem because now we have to chase the fish down and make sure it doesn't get snapped. We're gonna have to walk him down there. Uh, yeah, you're gonna go swimming oh, is yo, what you're gonna have to do. Go, I'm recording. Go swimming now before he wraps you around. It's not, don't worry about it. You can swim, bro. Just take the drag off. Hurry up, hurry up. Go around that tree. Go around that tree. Go around that tree. Go, give me the rod, I'll do it. 
take the camera, I'll do it, bro. I got all you. Here, hand me the rod. Hand me the rod. You have to go around that branch, bro. Here, 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 here. Go in, go in, go in. Go, 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 go. I'll meet you down there. Real, real, real. Is he on? I'm gonna go get the gloves, okay? Do you have the glove? It's in my pocket. Okay, sweet. Harris, you're a, you're a legend for this. I'm not letting you lose this fish, bro. I, I love you, bro. Oh Let's my god. Here. Come on. We have to get this thing. This thing is enormous. Hold on, meet me out here. Take this. Here, take the rod. Hey, hold this, hold this. I can, I can, I can just pump him in. Hold on. Is he stuck? I don't know. No, no, he's just heavy. Super heavy. You gotta get him over here. Watch your step. I think you got him. He just head. Is he in something? I don't think so, dude. I don't know. So I gotta go out there. The fish had gotten wrapped around the tree branch, and now it's a race against time to get this fish out before it breaks me off. I believe in you! Follow the line! Oh my God. Quick, quick! Go out and tighten hey. your drag! Real man, real man. Give me the rod, give me the rod. Kill him. After 30 minutes of trying to get this fish untangled, we decided the right thing to do was cut the line and try again the next day. So it is the next day here, and we actually got a hotel. Uh, we last minute booked the hotel because I am not leaving without a fish. So we loaded up on tackle. There's a bass pro across the street from our hotel, and uh, we're gonna head back to the spot kayak back out there and we're not leaving until i get a fish so we'll see you guys back at the spot i had just hooked into what feels like the biggest fish i've ever hooked in my entire life we immediately hopped into the kayak and followed the fish knowing that it would try wrapping us up in branches it's dragging us around the canal guys oh the river the river dude okay. fine dude, we came prepared this time we had the kayak next to us Okay, turn, turn the kayak, the nose a little to that way. Actually, back up, back up, back up. You know what? I don't want to be under that. Back up, back up, yeah. Sweet, this is good, this is good. Okay, back up, back up, paddle back. I had told my cameraman to put down the camera as landing this fish was more important to me than getting anything on the video. Okay, I think he's hooked now. I think he's... He just woke, he just woke up, dude. He just woke up. I think... Oh! They're everywhere. They're jumping over us. Landing this fish would be a dangerous task as there's multiple sturgeon jumping in and could potentially knock us out. Dude, he just woke up. What the? Oh, he just, he just got real heavy. Dude, this might be the big one. I hope we get him. He's 100% big. <laughs> Ain't no small one dogging us. No. Oh no, you got a giant, bro. We haven't even seen him on the surface yet. I don't like when he does that. No, I don't either. Praying, at, praying, at praying to the Lord. Please don't let me lose this fish. Please. Praise the Lord if you got this thing, man. This thing is well over 100 pounds. I'm telling you that right now. Yeah. You just like Harris. When I tell you, like, I can feel like holding the rod, I can feel how heavy it is. You know? We got a glimpse of this monster for the first time after one hour of fighting and it turned out to be one of the rarest fish in Florida. Knowing how dangerous you the gloves? fish was, we decided to beach the kayak and land the fish safely. Guys, we had to walk, we had a kayak one mile down, we had a kayak one mile down the river. He pulled us all over the river. And there was, boat, there was one boat that almost ran us over. We had to scream at them. How long are we gonna find this thing, an hour? I'm exhausted, dude. Day two. Been this for an hour. Oh my god. Don't let him go around that tree, bro. Back up, bro. Don't worry about the gator. The gator ain't gonna bother you. Focus. Move the stick. Oh, that stick's not a stick. It's a branch. Get up. You gotta sacrifice now for the reward later. He's coming back. He's swimming. Put him on while I grab him. Uh, uh, 
After fighting this fish for what now feels like forever, we finally got him right in front of us where we wanted. And now it was time to land the fish carefully. Oh, Guys, <clears throat> this is one of the biggest fish. This is just the biggest fish I've ever caught. This is a gulf sturgeon, guys. Super rare species, guys. Gotta keep water flowing. This thing might be pushing 200 pounds, like so big. Dangerous fish, dangerous fish. Be careful, guys. Look at this thing. 200 pounds easily. Go ahead and release him. Oh my God, oh, he's ready. Oh. He's ready. <laughs> he bumped into me. <laughs> Let's get it. Woo! He's out. Guys, that was probably one of my biggest fish I've ever caught. But I do want to say a side note. These fish are critically endangered. They are federally protected. We did not target this fish. It was a complete mistake. We were for catfish and gar. And unexpectedly, we caught the craziest fish of a lifetime for me personally. And it was a crazy experience for my buddy as well. But we're going to go head back in now. Guys, we're kayaking back now. I think that's the biggest fish I've ever caught in my life. And we're going to catch bigger fish from here. Thank you Crazy. guys for tuning in. We're exhausted. I'll see, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Please like, comment, and subscribe. A lot of money went into this trip and I'm getting no money from it, so. Sasa Productions, baby. Take care. Subscribe to the channel.